Hello everyone, welcome to Haley Moon Tarot. This is a quick bonus reading for Pisces. How does your love interest feel about you? What are their feelings for you, Pisces? What does Pisces love interest feel about them? What are their feelings for Pisces? What does Pisces love interest or their person feel about them? Ah, this person's holding back, healing, clearing their energy. All right, this is sometimes just somebody who's taking a little break. Okay, healing, yeah. So somebody's trying to heal something. They're trapped in their head. Uh, they want to clear this energy out. They just want to get out of this cycle. Uh, somebody was overthinking, so yeah, it's definitely a healing. There's a cycle that needs to end here. Whoops. We have two cards here. So yes, oh, actually this goes here. Somebody wants to come in and share their feelings. So there's been a holding back, clearing the energy, getting out of this trap. Somebody wants to come in and share their feelings. They want to take action with the Knight of Wands. All right, this is coming in. Hey, do you want to go out and talk? Let's talk and clear the air. Okay, somebody feels this way. Okay, somebody's still a little bit PO'd, maybe anxious and impatient to clear the air. So they're going to come in and offer up a date possibly uh, or say, look, look, let's share our feelings. Let's talk about this. Okay, I care about you. I want to clear the air. So let's see what's happening here. Hold on here. All right. Pisces, how does your person feel about you? What are their feelings for you? Yeah, this person feels like there's not a lot of hope here. They're anxious, they're impatient. They kind of feel like you were indecisive. Uh, maybe you were a bit wishy-washy, came in offering up a cup of love, and then you were indecisive. Uh, they feel like you might still be angry, like there's not a lot of hope. So they're holding back. Yeah, somebody's holding back that cup. They want to, but they're indecisive about it because they're not sure. Uh, someone feels that someone didn't take their, you know, that... Um, Someone regrets not seeing how you feel about things, Pisces, or they feel like there's not a lot of hope in this because somebody's feelings weren't taken into consideration. Somebody feels some regret for being indecisive, angry, impatient. All right, maybe not offering up this cup. Yeah, somebody has regret and remorse. Oh my goodness, somebody's feeling bad. Where did that other card go? Oh, I guess it was that one. Yeah, so someone's weighing the pros and the cons here about a situation trying to make a decision about whether to extend to that cup to get together and talk uh, to clear the air but this indecisive energy again it's down here weighing the pros and the cons trying to get the balance trying to make the decision feeling indecisive stressing out about it not able to do it feeling like there's no hope yeah so somebody feels kind of beat up they've had a tough time in love here queen of cups has a tough time somebody's hoping to have forgiveness to reach out they're trying to make a decision, hoping that somebody will forgive them, all right, or, you know, there's some kind of forgiveness or a cup of love being offered so things can heal. It's a he healing love offer. It's a nurturing. Um, it's, it's a tower. <laughs> yeah, so somebody definitely... feels beat up there somebody could be having an epiphany or feeling like it's just kind of over like it can't go anywhere even if they offer up that cup and forgiveness could be a surprise you could pisces get have a cancer pisces or scorpio uh coming towards you all right they could reach out uh could come as a surprise they may ask for forgiveness they say let's get together i, I want to talk about this i need to share my feelings with you because uh, I feel like they've kind of healed and cleared the air. They've been holding back, but I don't think they can hold back anymore. It's the stress is getting to them. Yeah, so somebody here, yeah, the tower come down. Somebody was kind of in and out here. There was an in and out energy with the Knight of Wands. But I feel like this person wants to come rushing in. And uh, they want forgiveness. And it's going to come as a surprise. They want to be forgiven for coming in and out. All right, rushing in, rushing out for the passion. Um, they've had an epiphany about this. They feel bad about it. Uh, they feel really bad. They feel like there's not a lot of hope, though. Um, they also feel like their feelings weren't taken into consideration here. So they're really worried about this and weighing the pros and the cons about they, whether they should reach out uh, or they're, you know, I feel like this is another one that could flip. So yes, flip this if you can. 
or if you need to. All right, how's this going for Pisces? What does their person feel about them? What is their feelings for Pisces? Yeah, so this person's um, has their feelings hidden. They're they're losing it. They're stressed out like really bad. <laughs> Uh, they're feeling angry, impatient, excited. They're feeling indecisive. They're feeling loved up like they want to offer love, but they're worried. They have regret and remorse. They feel there's no hope. <laughs> it's like they're hiding their feelings. They're like a lunatic in love. I feel it too. I feel it like somebody is just trapped in their head. Like this is really heavy. Uh, and it has to do with this in and out energy rushing in and rushing out for the passion the tower came down somebody wants to be forgiven they want to offer this love uh, this is somebody is really in need of some nurturing and some tlc here and uh, let's see what's happening they feel like they are oh yes yeah, so yeah somebody was hiding their feelings about this connection there was there might have been some secrets here too where somebody was hiding another connection that they had somebody else because uh, two cups is two people two lovers two situations yeah, there may have been that. Somebody was going in and out between two people, keeping it a secret, or somebody was hiding their feelings. They were just rushing in and out for the passion, putting a lot of pa energy into the passion part, but not but keeping their emotions completely hidden. So, yeah, there, someone's having an epiphany about why this happened, what happened. And while they're going through this tower moment, they're feeling a lot of regret, a lot of anxiety, like heavy uh, wanting one minute wanting to rush forward and talk about it and extend to this cup asking for forgiveness or just sharing their feelings uh, with this this is um, unconditional love somebody still loves somebody they still have a lot of feelings for them regardless of what happened uh, but it's all hidden it's been hidden but there's a lot of illusions and confusion yeah somebody wants to stabilize this they want to make this stable uh, they want this to you know it, it's just been all over I feel somebody wants to get their emotions under control and get things stable. Uh, they're ready for commitment. They want someone didn't feel safe and secure because there was too many secrets and that's what happened. So the tower came down. Yeah, but there's still this connection. This is still two people who are connected. You're still in each other's energy. I feel Pisces very strong. Someone certainly feels their feelings weren't taken into consideration and they are a little bit angry about that. Uh, because there was this cup of love offered it's like someone rushed in to offer a cup but they kept one foot in the door one foot out kind of energy you know mr romance mrs romance then they became indecisive so it was a very in and out so what's going on here with pisces how does this person feel about pisces what are their feelings yeah this person doesn't want to let go they're holding on to all this energy it's they're trapped in their head having a hard time letting go somebody was being selfish um yeah someone was being very selfish um very stubborn but they don't want to let go they want this new beginning they want to make an offer there is going to be a new beginning here there is going to be a talk you're going to get together and talk about this i feel it is going to become stable um yeah so you're both could be mirroring each other you're both feeling the same way manifesting a way to fix this we have virgo gemini energy yeah definitely something needs to be fixed there was some kind of manipulation or somebody feels they were it needs to be fixed there needs someone's trying to think of creative ways to uh, manifest this new beginning uh, what to say what to do because they don't want to let go someone's really holding on to this and the more they pay attention to the details of everything that happened between you uh, the worse they feel okay and uh, they're looking at this new beginning they want to make this offer to start new brand spanking new okay and that's what they want to do the sun is shining and, and you know illuminating this this pinnacle and making everything the details are becoming very clear of what needs to be done uh, there needs to be an offer a, a new seed planted something new all right one more card for pisces yeah so this person yeah they want to offer uh, to get together, go out, have a drink, talk. Okay, they want something new. So this is, you know, going out, having a drink, getting together, sharing your feelings, putting your feelings out there. It's the community, you know, things out in the open. Everything needs to be out in the open. There needs to be an offer. So I feel like there may be a date. Somebody may offer, like, look, let's just go out, um, you know, and have a few drinks, 
chill, share our feelings, keep it on, you know, keep it chill, start from the bottom and start over by dating, uh, that kind of thing. Uh, but someone's definitely a lunatic in love. They hit all their feelings uh, and someone didn't feel safe because there was too many secrets. There was too much going on that they didn't know about. Yeah, there's an offer. Someone's thinking and pondering this, how to do this right. They're thinking about right this minute, I feel somebody is just sitting there going, should I say this? Should I send this message? How do I go about this? How do I say the right thing? How do I make this happen? Okay, they're not really moving. They're just thinking about it, right? Thinking about how to make this right, how to get what they want, how to um, get things to go in their favor, okay? So they're thinking about this. They're at the Page of Pentacles stage, and um, they definitely want to. They are thinking about an offer of saying, look, look, let's just start by dating. I don't want to let go of this. Um, you know, there is love, there is emotions, there is feeling. Can you forgive me uh, for not sharing my feelings, for not making you feel safe? You know, look at this. This is so beautiful. I keep my eye keeps getting drawn to this because you see this couple, you know, they're they're leaning into each other. It's so beautiful. They're so safe and secure. Uh, they feel so protective of each other. It's very grounded, beautiful energy. They're solid. Um, nothing's gonna tear those two apart, right? That's the kind of energy. Beautiful. Wow, Pisces. Tell me about this Ten of Pentacles. Tell me more about this Ten of Pentacles. How does Pisces person feel about them in regards to this Ten of Pentacles? Yeah, this person's definitely... Uh... Wow. Somebody's trusting their intuition here. Yeah, I feel like what's happened is someone was trusting their intuition, their gut, that they couldn't feel safe and secure. There was too many secrets, but I feel like someone's been kind of keeping score here. They're, it's like uh, the Pisces to me is also a seer. Uh, it's kind of like the Hierophant in some ways, right? Uh, very It's very spiritual energy, but this is somebody who's um, looking into the crystal ball, looking for answers, answers, maybe even a tarot card reader, right? All the tarot cards there, the crystal ball, we've even got runes. So, yeah, so somebody's looking into the future here, um, hoping things can stabilize. Trusting their gut, their instinct, right? Their intuition that this could happen. Wow, somebody's really, uh, yeah, that's how it fell apart too. Somebody trusted their intuition that things, they couldn't feel safe with somebody. It wouldn't stabilize. This couldn't be a stable connection, even though they felt this was beautiful. It was a soulmate. But we all know not all soulmates end up together. So tell me more about this high priestess. Why is this high priestess here? Why is the high priestess here for Pisces? Yeah, so this is tempering and balancing that. So somebody needs to temper something, balance something, and heal something here. Very, very spiritual energy. Somebody is definitely trusting their gut that this situation can be stabilized if everything is tempered, if everything is healed, right? There's so much chemistry and connection here uh, between these two people. Um, it's like the difference between black and white, but it's also yin and yang. Uh, really cool. Uh, I like that energy, to be honest. Yeah, it's a very spiritual connection between these two people. Both people are highly intuitive, highly sensitive. Uh, it's, it's what's bringing you together. Um, it feels like the divine is bringing the two of you together. Something needs to happen here. Uh, somebody is going to reach out, I feel. They know intuitively that this could stabilize. This could become a very lovely uh, connection. Yeah, there, this could end up in marriage, commitment. There's justice. Two people are a perfect fit. Look at that. Emperor energy. Someone's going to come in and take control of this situation and make things right. And the emperor can do that. The emperor has the power uh, to make anything right. this The emperor has the power to uh, hand down justice as well. And this, when the emperor says something's going to be made right, it's going to be made right. <laughs> All right. So, wow. <laughs> yes. Yes. 
The emperor is going to see to it. Somebody has very strong boundaries about being treated right, about things being just right, and about marriage and commitment. The emperor is going to see to it. This is somebody who gets what they want, and uh, they're not afraid to go after it, not one bit. Mm -mm. Oops, all right, one more card. Tell me about this. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so see? Somebody has hopes and dreams. They feel like this situation might be a little out of reach, but they're trusting their intuition that this can be, um, there can, this can balance out. There will be justice. I think the emperor is going to hand down justice and they're going to make sure everything is just right and there's marriage. Someone's holding them high, in high regard. Somebody uh, has their hopes and dreams. Something is getting purged and released, healed and made right. The emperor is insisting on it. So... Uh, we got Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius. We got Cancer, Pisces. Oh, you name it. We got the whole Zodiac family here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Uh, pretty heavy Sag, Gemini, Virgo. Uh, doesn't have to be any of these. It's really an energy. But there's definitely a need of forgiveness. Somebody's had a tough time in love. Somebody's ready to reach out. It's going to be a shock. Um, there is something that needs to be healed and cleared up and somebody wants forgiveness and they're weighing the pros and the cons about how to go about this. All right, they're trying to make a decision about how to go about this. They're taking their sweet time though. They're, uh, this is somebody who's probably a little stressed, a little bit worried, has a lot of anxiety about whether they can do it, but they certainly don't want to let go of this connection. Yeah. One more card. Tell me about this page of pentacles. There we go. Yeah, so there's a cycle that's going to end. This person's going to make sure everything goes in their favor because they're going to do it right. All right. They want to say the right thing to put an end to this past, to get out of the head, get out of this cycle, and have things move in their favor. So this could be an emperor coming in, Pisces, to take control. Uh, this person has very strong boundaries, but when they want justice, they're going to get it, period, isn't you can't fight the emperor. The emperor is going to win every time here. Okay. Justice, balance, healing. Somebody's trusting their gut. Somebody's feeling spiritually guided that this is going to happen. Um, there's going to be a healing here, a purging of old energies, and things are going to be made right. Beautiful. All right, I'm going to let you guys go. Stay tuned for Thursdays. Uh, weekly readings. All right. Take care, everyone. I wish this, hope this works out the way you want. Crazy energy. Bye for now.